This is Dan's uh, Dunlop Crybaby, Jimi Hendrix version, supposedly. Although I've spotted uh, some anomalies on the circuit board. Um, uh, this was dead. Um, the uh, Dan had replaced the faulty switch uh, with this one from J-Car. Uh, there's a bit of a rewire needed on that, but then it still didn't work. Um, then I managed to get it to uh, go when I plugged the external power supply in. It would work intermittently. Interestingly, the battery supply didn't work at all. So I knew there was something uh, dodgy with this board here. Um, same old problem, Sur surface mounted connectors, screwed to a chassis, and then you've got something that moves all the time, um, can break the connections on the back of the board, and in this case it was the uh, actual power connector, has got a little uh, mechanism inside it that disconnects the battery when you plug in the um, external power, and uh, where is it, one of these legs here, I forget which one it was. It was. Um, where's my chopstick? It was this one here. This little connector here, the track had broken and it was just going intermittent, so I just scratched it back and resoldered it. Uh, and I. Um, bit of process of elimination. I did some others. I wet some other joints to make sure there wasn't a dry joint somewhere. Because I could tell uh, when I was flexing the board that it was uh, starting and stopping but that ended up to be the the track there that was the problem uh, and now um, let's see now let's send it some signal from my tone generator from this little amplifier here the tones coming in here and you can hear it working there now. Bypass. So, uh, fixed. Um, I'll put it back together and we'll give it a run through this.